today I'm at the zoo with my Pixel 4a. So walking with it, like how does this look? Is it shaky? If it is, I'm gonna be using my gimbal. I'm gonna be taking some pictures for you. Vlogging on every phone I try is important because it's important to me to know that video and pictures look good on whatever phone I'm using. I gotta say that the uh, front-facing camera stabilization is uh, pretty good. And this is the back-facing camera, the forward-facing camera. I'd like to know how this looks. Now we're gonna test a continuous video. See how long I can record uh, continuously and if it will split up files. Here you go.
walking on that same path again and that clip was recorded for over 20 minutes. So I've heard that Androids kind of have an issue with recording over long periods of time. I wanted to use a flagship Android phone and see if that's still an issue. And it's not. I mean, it might be if you're recording for hours on end. Let's get on to the rest of the video. Let's see. Here's some pictures that I took around the zoo after that long video. Hope you enjoyed those pictures. Here, warthogs, if I can see it. The zoo. So, I'm coming to the end of my visit to the zoo today. This is where I will do phone camera reviews in the future. I'm using my Zhuin Smooth X gimbal. I think I might head out, go get some lunch or breakfast as I haven't eaten yet. As you exit the zoo, there is this Discovery Center. Here's the clip of me going in there, looking around. Now I'm gonna leave. now uh, we're gonna unbox this we've got a little pull tab thing here pull that off it opens up it's got a little Fitbit logo there and it pulls out just like that got some plastic over the screen uh, and here we have the charger uh, it's not inductive it's it's got connector points you got a manual and we have the watch. I'm going to pull this down, take off my Apple Watch. Take this guy, pull this off. I'm gonna pull this open. It's got a little screen. 
I'm not sure if it'll even have touch controls. Oh, it's turning on. I'm gonna put this guy on. This is a hundred bucks. This does not, I mean, it feels fancier than the ones that are this size that I've tried before, but it also just feels like without having a larger touch screen, a uh, hundred bucks kind of seems expensive.